What's up guys, this is Save Knight, and welcome back to Dark Parables, Queen of Sands, Collector's Edition. Chapter 2, made my way into the uh, main gate, or main street, and I was trying to talk to this woman that tried to talk to me for whatever reason she wanted to talk to me for, and that man-beast thing threw a freaking wagon at her. And now I can't find her. I don't know if she's crushed under the wagon or if she actually got out. Montefleur is a young town, but known for its beauty and fashion. Okay, I have map now. Yep, main street. I can't get a good grip to pull it out of there. Jeweled shard. The bakery's crests have fallen off the lock. This marble statue probably broke during the commotion. Okay. The statue of the moon goddess. Interesting. That. By tree of 39. Flint and steel. I find six objects in eight seconds. Finish a hop without any hints and whatever you just said. Flint and steel. Would I just pick up? Find six objects in eight seconds. Find 80 objects. Finish a hop without any mistakes. Perfection, finish two without hints in 60 seconds. Quick mine, solve it in 30 seconds. Puzzle yourself two mini games without skipping. Swift feet quickly teleport using the map. Yeah, they also added a, um, a whatchamacallit. There's Montefleur's Town Square. I've got to keep moving forward. Oily Cloth. Flint and Steel. Torch. What a curious lock. Can't fit my hand through the grating. Why would you want to? There goes my torch. Maybe I need a different approach. Seems an ornamental piece has fallen off. Flowers that goes to that statue. Oh, she's okay, but before I go mess with you, cloak emblem and broken pendant. A mist has fallen upon this town, one that twists everything it touches into a nightmare. However, I found a pouch of sand that reverses the spell. Don't believe me? Try it on these moths. Here, you'll need it. I I'm going to the perfume factory. Perhaps we can use it to disperse this sand over the town. Alrighty. Pouch of golden sand. This sand worked on those moths. Maybe it can solve my wolf problem. Ah. Okay, go down. Go 
go across. I think this thingy goes in here. For a swords emblem and a ruby fert. I think those go here now. A wood frame and a wheat crest. Do I just Chris sprinkle? Wait a minute, that's Ruth the Wolf. The purple mist must have transformed him into a monster. Shadow seems happy to see me. It's been a while since I last visited the sisters. We'll be fair, okay, so I'll probably need, a, need a, another one. To train, to protect, and to honor. If I'm not mistaken, this is the insignia for the Red Riding Hood sisters. Okay. Wooden frame, cloak emblem. Advance the story by finding the missing elements shown in the bubbles. Interact with objects in the scene to find the hidden items. Puzzle to solve whatever without skipping. To the abandoned cottage. Ruth, I'm glad she's alright. It's time to compare notes. And a puppy! Ooh, this is a big sweetie. Faucet handle is missing. worse by the minute we searched everywhere but we still haven't found any leads we logged everything in that book on the table you keep searching I'm returning to base for backup don't I know who the hell Brian is must be like a new sister this situation is worse than I thought but at least the sisters have been taking notes oh I got left the puppy you bitch Brian and I saw a strange beast standing upright on a rooftop. We took chase but lost him among the dark alleys, taking shelter until dawn. This morning, dark clouds have surrounded Montefleur. Brienne discovered several books mentioning the Queen of Sands, a leader of the Sandmen, who can control dreams and nightmares. The Queen of Sands is real, and she attacked us. But aren't Sandmen benevolent beings? Perhaps that beast has something to do with this. Once the sun rises, we'll find him. I just mean. What could cause a quiet city like this to burst into chaos so suddenly? Herald of Montefleur. Someone who lives here must be a healer. I mean, there's red hot. I should put out the fire. Lavender fields. This 
to her feet. Wheat crest. No, that does not go there. I handle dough crest, okay. Curse bloosh. Envelope emblem. Some of the decorations have been ripped off. Yeah, it's stag crest. Stag crest and dough crest. Deer token and ocean perfume. I think that's for this mailbox. Caduceus, 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 could what? Could something? It's like a staff with like two wings with like twin snakes wrapped around. It's like a healing symbol. Another pouch. Jade Furt. Jade Furt and the Ruby Furt. Baker Crest. Phase two hops without hits for six in sixty seconds. Guess the other half of that crest thing. Huh, wonder what that was not activating for. To the bakery. It's really dark in here. Everything seems normal here. All those must have locked up and left quickly. Ruth and Brienne. People are being turned into creatures by that purple mist. I tracked down that beast I told you about, but I can't catch him. What's worse, I haven't slept in days. My nightmares are becoming unbearable. Going home to research those creatures in our library. Stay safe, sisters. Jessica. Red Riding Hood sisters I've been investigating here for a while, it seems. Oop. So you've been earned Sage? What is Sage? Oh, parables. Okay. Okay, the goddess's gift. Oh god. Since the dawn of time, the goddess of the moon has protected the people of Earth from evil forces. She bestowed upon them many magical relics and artifacts to ease their hardships. Because, you know, she also gave them the moon orbs and the moon whatever the crap in number four. The moon goddess was bestowed, I'm sorry, was beloved by the people of Earth, so they built many temples in her honor. In return for their gratitude, she granted them the ability to dream as they slept. God has created the Keepers, beings who visited the humans each night, sprinkling golden sand across their eyes which made them dream. 
The few humans who saw these creatures called them the Sandmen for the magic sand they carried. The Keepers were quiet beings who kept to themselves. They did not influence humanity, but instead watched their dreams with curiosity and awe. As time passed, the humans forgot about the goddess's gift and the Sandmen faded into a legend told to young children to help them sleep well. Okay. Interesting. Tongs? I want pie. Orchid perfume? Locke has a little relief showing something taking honey from a hive. Who harrowed the Montefleur? Smoker? So many ingredients. Must have made some really nice pastries. It's clear what belongs here. Not really. A frog? And a gear with crank. Okay, so I think that... That's probably for this right here. Finally, let's see what's ahead. To the Fountain Square. Yeah. Things ache. Lions must be the mascot for the Montefleur family. They're all over the city. Herald of Montefleur. Seems someone has been stealing little animal figures. It's a froggy. I'm missing a... Got a bird and a dragonfly. Shears. But an odd little shape. Not sure what that's supposed to be. It's not what I wanted to do. I've always wanted to see the world famous Montefleur clock tower. This time. Wait, but this is no time to sightsee. I'm on the clock. Perfume bottles must be the key to opening the perfume shop. I'm still missing one. Okay. To the sh How on earth is this gate open? Oof. Okay, to the shrine. Yeah, talk about uh oh. Oh. Hello, Mr. Like. Not another one. This big guy is blocking the whole. What do you mean, not another one? When have you fought these before? Harold of Montefleur. If only I had used all that magical sand on Ruth's wolf. Like, hello, Mr. Ice Thrall or. Frost Golem, or whatever the hell you want to call yourself. Fairy Emblem. Something is tangled in the roots. Shears? A Heron. Almost said Heroin. Can't risk that monster attacking me.
am I missing? Oh, this thing. Okay, now I can do that here. Alright. Metal perfume. Metal perfume. Okay, so I guess you're wanting to smell like grass. Hop without any mistakes. Then I have to do a third one without using hens. All right, so that's the three perfumes: ocean perfume, metal perfume, and orchid perfume. You know, I thought orchids were purple, but whatever. That was too close. Oh, we were lucky. This is the factory's perfume store. The lab must be nearby. Must be a secret way to the factory's laboratory. Jeweled gecko. This tile is hollowed out. I could fit something in there. I could pull it free. The fleur de lis fell off. After several late nights in the library, I found the ancient scrolls. They describe the sandmen in great detail, though the scrolls call them keepers of dreams. Their sand may be just what I need to complete my scent of dreams. A scent of dreams? Sounds more like chasing a dream to me. Beast took Brienne, looked a bit like this statue. Someone removed the pendant from his neck. Aha! Must be a secret door. But how does it open? If I replace the moon shape, will something happen? Golden goddess. One of the handles fell off. Yeah, but they kind of combined them, it looks like. They combined the, uh... The parable with the... Cursed morphing object. Wait, so where am I at right now? The perfume store? Perfume shop. Backyard garden. Brass handle. Life finds a way, but a helping hand doesn't hurt. Looks like a crystal fits here. That could be why the garden has dried up. Herald of Mount of Fleur, number der, 9 of 39. Judging by the water stains, this used to be a waterfall. Why did it dry up? The garden must depend on that well for water, but it looks empty. Be you agitate, I need something to calm down. Smoker. I can safely look inside. I'm going to pull it free. Get my hands sticky. Gem Heart and Golden Sun. That must be Baron de Montefleur's manor. Maybe he knows what's going on. Oh, the big house in the background. Stop 
doing that. Okay, take that. Combine it with that. Fix the kitty cat necklace. handle part of the journal is lock is missing floral orb someone remove the portrait okay, I don't have a portrait okay for that. Durr, that went. Why don't I go here? No. Where the hell? Oh, right here. Like, where the hell did I see that? Range of colored lights in rows and columns according to the markings on the shields. Select any two lights to swap them. Okay, so I, okay, so that all has to be triangles. It has to be two squares and a circle. Many games without skipping. Huzzah! Okay, well that I just get or do. Perfume lab. It's the lab. Must be getting close to the factory. Where did that old woman go? Seems some kind of bore used to hang here. Okay, I don't have a beard. So that one, two out of three. Small lever. There's a book missing here. Panel must open when the books are in order. Ay ay ay. Oh, things are crapping. Machine can't operate if the pressure gauge is missing. Okay, I don't have a pressure gauge. So this is where the perfume magic happens. Finally, I have found the secret ingredient. The first batch of the new perfume was exquisite, and it sold out immediately. My business will certainly take off. It's a dream come true. That secret ingredient sounds suspicious. Can it be connected to the case? Mechanical Bjord. So the board thing went here. Farm panels missing something in the center.
small lever on that. Golden bee and fly key. Know exactly where both of those go. So now that I look at it, it's like okay, that is a bee. Like I can't tell. Bear fragment and golden wreath. still in the store. No, the, uh, the bakery. Brass portraits and fleur de lis. God, so much running back and forth. Like, so much back and forth makes me want to get a fifth. Said I didn't really read it. Jewel the flower and man fragment. Father's been in the study for hours, finishing his new fragrance. He still won't let me in, but he did promise to reveal his secret ingredient one day. Why doesn't he trust me? Eric really had no idea what his father was hiding all those years. The wreath has been pried off. A golden wreath. Golden goddess. Woman fragment. Either whatever that is right there on that side. Pressure gauge. Pressure gauge. Okay. Pumpkin token.
plant the pumpkins by pushing the seeds into the dirt squares using your pincers. Press the arrow buttons to move the pincers in that direction. Seeds cannot be pulled, only pushed, so avoid pushing them against the wall. Jesus, I was like so fucking long and convoluted. Oh my god. Upon a time, there was an honest man who provided for his family, never shunning a hard day's work. Sounds like a person with good virtues. Okay, what is this? Lead the woman to the raven on the right by moving her to the nearest empty spaces. Move the animal tokens to help rotate the branches off the path. Branches won't rotate if they hit another object.
was also a young woman lost in the forest. Nightmares prevented her from sleeping, so she searched day and night for a cure to her insomnia. Wouldn't want to be in her shoes. Some of the Tangram pieces, so they form a complete figure with no overlapping pieces. Select a piece and then choose where you like to place that piece. are intertwined by fate. Orion Stone. And I guess I take the mechanical board back. you. What have you done? All of my efforts ruined. Okay, you were like an inch away from my face. It's the beast that took Brienne. He can talk, and he's not attacking me? some reason. Forgive me, detective. I let my rage consume me. I see your intentions are noble, but I was trying to keep Mab from reaching the lab. Have you rhymed? Don't let this beastly appearance deceive you. I am actually Baron Eric de Montefleur. It's my duty to protect the people of this town said duty. I've been caring for Brienne at my manor. We can get there quickly through the well. I'll guide you. Okie dokie. Beast is Baron de Montefleur? What happened to him? Did I pick up the thing in here? Yes, okay. Guess to the well cellar? The secret cellar. My store's fragrance ingredients down here. Alrighty, and there's the end of chapter two. When we come back, I will start chapter three in the well cellar, and I guess make my way up to his manor. Yeah, meet Brienne at Eric's manor. So until then, this is Save Night on Let's Play Dark Parables, Queen of Sands, Collector's Edition. Later, guys.